And very similar to a new birth, fairs are a great way to bring people together and give farmers and ranchers a break during the busy summer months. The Montana Ag Network's Lane Nordland introduces us to a Hall of Fame fair manager who has made a big impact on fairs in Montana and across the West. Bill Ogg was surprised and honored in the fall of 2018 when he was inducted into the Rocky Mountain Association of Fairs Hall of Fame. Og began his career at the Wyoming State Fair in 1980 at the age of 26, making him the youngest fair manager in the nation at that time. And since then, he has made an impact on communities and fairs across the nation, and it all took a little elbow grease, he said. And uh, substituted some elbow grease and enthusiasm for any lack of knowledge of that side of the desk. I had a fairly strong 4-H and FFA background and exhibition experience, but the management side of it... Uh, was a, a brand new challenge and after a, several years I was hooked and it was a vocation and so from Wyoming State Fair to Montana State Fair in Great Falls in large part because of an influence of a, again a great mentor and friend Bill Chiazza, longtime manager both in Great Falls and, and then here in Billings. From the Electric City, Og went on to manage the Kansas State Fair, then coming back to Great Falls, then managing the Greeley Stampede in Colorado Currently, Bill and his wife call Washington home, where he manages the Walla Walla Fair and Frontier Days. But to have a successful event, it takes countless individuals, time, and management. For Bill Ogg, growing up in agriculture gave him a strong foundation of knowledge and work ethic to be a successful fair manager. I've had a wonderful career, and... Um, Certainly there's been sacrifices, but it was as close to production agriculture as I could get with the, the opportunities that were afforded me. Grew up in Worland, Wyoming, just south of here, 160 miles, and uh, on a family farming and ranching operation, and older brother was uh, rightfully the, the heir apparent to that, and so the rest of us got to go find other jobs. At the end of the day, Og says fairs are all about people. Helping people have fun and watching people you know promote agriculture and, and achieve things you know you, you can't help but uh, be moved when when one of those freckle faced kids gets that grand champion ribbon and when it's you know and when it's well deserved it's just so awesome and so the the participation in 4-H and FFA is, is very strong and near to me personally. A well-deserved honor for a man committed to bettering individuals' lives in rural America. In Billings, Lane Nordland, MTN News. And now with another look at our weather, Chief Meteorologist Curtis Grevitz. Well, some of that recent snow that fell is either getting blown away or is melting across north-central Montana. 